All right, we are finally back with Mafia 3. Been a minute since I played it. I ain't gonna cap. So I'm reading this book review in the paper. And they gave away the end. Alright. Got my strap on me. Zero ammo. I got the Tommy gun. Sal though. didn't have nothing to do with it. You ever see Michael Greco have an original? You lost You be fun. cool. Something's going down. Oh, 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 I need help here. Lunatic. I'm just gonna call about an altercation in River Row. Someone passed through there. If you're so inclined. Come on. Come on. Come on. Down, boy. Tell me what's going down at Roy's warehouse. The boss is trying to get medical supplies to Cuba for extra cash. I know where the shipment is. Come on. Your ass belongs to me. That would be as many as, uh, as I can get. Come on, come on. I can't see it. Oh. Bruh, as much as I want the money, I can. There we go. Ain't what I heard. Roy's in deep. Too deep. And knows it, which makes the mother expendable. I'm the master at lock picking, bro. I'm telling you. Wow, that was a lot of noise. A hot bat, okay, A, A. Press A for that, okay. So your ass is too good for her, that it? Did I say that? Peggy just ain't my type. I heard what you said to Spicoli. She's so ugly the tire wouldn't take her out. Oh. Oh, I wasn't talking about Peggy. Well, who then? Pizza face, peace, little girl. Ooh, yeah, <clears throat> that poor thing. Looks like her face caught on fire and they put it out with a fog. What? All right, I don't have to take him out. I can just, all I need is a truck, really. <clears throat> we need to get this shit moved out. Take my shot! Send him to us! Need to reload! Don't you know you're dead? Drop the mother <laughs> Can I get a resupply in River Road? Going at you. Hang tight. I'm dead, dude. Oh, they popped my tire. Well, shit! Oh. My bad. Oh, and they called the cops. All units, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrol. Repeat, pursuit is called searching. off. Abandon search and return to I patrol. <laughs> What's this? Medical supplies, antibiotics, bandages, bunch of other stuff. Thought you could put it to good use. I probably don't want to know where this came from. Don't ask and I won't have to tell you. Fair enough. I know some folks who can use this. I'll take it from here. Big mistake, asshole. 
let me win my I'm ducking down. That f can't be here. Get him. Get around him while he's pinned. I'm not pinned down, sucker. I'm gonna pin you down where you are. I'm gonna catch y'all from behind. Stay out of my come to oh. Oh. Cover my ass. Fuck go last him. So much blood. Look at Got him! Blood. Get over here! Don't worry, we're Get down. It's going on long enough. This is dead. That's what I'm talking about. Anybody follow you? Boy, it's rattled. Scared of Greco. Terrified of you. <laughs> Heard he started sleeping at the warehouse. It's the only place he feels safe. Good. Means I have an easier time getting my hands on him. Once he's taken care of, we'll move in. Vito will turn things around. You'll see. That poor fuck boy is back at the warehouse. Do what you gotta do. Pointer turned the TV off as soon as the captain put his mouth on Uhura. The fucking kids don't care. Your boy's what? Six? Seven? What's up, mate? And you don't have to tell me. But you know Murna and her people. The Southern Union connection. I let my kid watch a white man kiss a woman. It's a lot more than last time. Her, her dad, her brothers, and a whole clap. No, thank you. Emotions come a lot quicker. When a man hit nuts, don't sneak in here and cut your goddamn throat. Maybe you should worry about that. Come by, come by. Yeah. <clears throat> Huh? Yep. Oh, that's why I can use this power for her. He probably told me that and I didn't pay attention. And I can't just... Don't like the sound of that! Oh, oh he know. noticed it. Don't win the thing. Oh no. I got a beat on him. You ticked off the wrong oh, come on. boy. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Hit him from the other side. Oh, he's coming yeah. up the other side. Miss. I'm over here. Stuck. Hit me. Like He's taking out the whole team. Getting out of here. Shit. Oh. Oh. Goddamn shooting gallery. Goddamn shooting gallery! Oh. 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 He wasn't playing. Oh. 
I put that right there. In my side, motherfucker! Let me pin! Me pinned. How do you know? You don't want to do this. Give me that thousand. Baby killed your ass anyway. Need you guys to secure the smuggling operation at the warehouse. Nice work. Those Fanooks never should have me. I'll send some of my crew. You take the Doc Union back, and that f***ing record will be done. Alright. I was gonna collect something right over there. But I can't now. Well, today I'm sure the file on Vito Skelet is about three feet thick, but that wasn't always the case. Hoover didn't even acknowledge the Mafia existed until 1957, so we weren't really keeping tabs on guys like Vittorio Scaletta till after that. Now, we know he served in World War II and did a six-year stint in prison for theft and illegal distribution of federal rations. It's, uh, it's generally believed he was a made member of the Falcone family in Empire Bay, though he's also a suspect in the death of Don Carlo Falcone. Now, if he did kill the Don, Vito must have had friends in high places because he was allowed to live. He was exiled, though, and forced to relocate down here. And the commission convinced Sal Marcano to make Vito a lieutenant and give him some rackets. All right. That's my truck. Too late, though. Go to sleep. Oh, oh. Huh? Hold that gun. See what happens. Yeah. I didn't need to counter that. Gonna put you down, son. Yo. A bit. Get behind him. I'm empty! Run. You think that scares me? Oh, hurry up. Get it. Oh, that's a bot. Oh. I'm inclined. Hang on. I'm a dip. Oh boy. And they're right there. It's cuffed down here. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. My nephew's moving to Chicago. Can't believe he's leaving the city. You don't belong here, friend. What's that? I think he's over here. Come on. It's been the same story for the last damn week. Come on. All units, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. Repeat, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. <laughs> Bruh. There's no way out. How can I jump? Fuck, fuck. Do you hear that? Holy Jesus! Run! Chill. That was nothing. Y'all heard nothing. 
I forgot my gun just automatically shoots. Well, Alright, how am I gonna get... I need a way to get past. I don't know how I'm gonna get past. Because I cannot unlock any of the doors. Bruh. Alright, right here. You'll move up when the old man thinks you're ready. Just give it time. I don't know, man. Maybe I should kiss up more. Yeah, if I was you. <clears throat> Y'all hear that? All right, two done. Let's go. To become hardened to the pain and suffering of others. My eyes have witnessed the mourning of women and children as they hold it. Go. Go. and work at the dock union i'm surprised to where it is andy toretto's down at the dock union demanding to know who's been stopping his people from collecting dues think he tipped off greco to what's been happening nah knowing andy he'd probably see greco in the ground next to you if he could but he's a lifer and if he's got a job to do he's gonna goddamn well do it bad f situation all around and it's about to get worse. Tell the boys they'll be back to work soon, Jock. Supposed to have my back. Mr. Toretto sees you stoned again, and he's gonna deal with you. <laughs> right. I was hired by old pal Michael fucking Greco. Untouchable. Huh? They don't even know. Ooh. I got this. Wait, do they? What? They don't. I thought they knew someone was here. You see that? F Come take a look. What did they just call him? Okay. Then we get in front of him, dude. Come on, come on. Entry right there. Right, this is really helpful. Check 
Found him. <laughs> Yo, chill. Oh boy. Ooh. You get flamed, oh. cocksucker. I am getting flamed. He's no. not wrong. Foul. Like a wisp. Come take a look. That would have been bad. And maybe and maybe not. Oh, I would have been a whole gunfight right there. And I hate going stealth. Oh, right there. Please be, yep. Okay, that didn't sound right. What? Come on, hurry up, bro. Right there. There's two right there. Alright. I heard he's huh? with that pretty little Creole girl. Lula? Lola. You want to Gotta get behind family? something! Uh, 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 of course you ordered them. Get down, get down, get down. You want, you want them? You want them? Yeah, get down, bro. Bro. There's no way this old man pushed a strong boy that was in the war far back. There's no way this old ass man did that, bro. There's no way. Yeah, I don't think he wants me to get killed. Swear to God, if I get killed this time. I'm all boxed in! Getting out of the line of fire! I'm the one you want, motherfucker! Can't be happening! Got nowhere to go! Hmm. Either you kill me, or that piss and Greco does. Well, since Greco ain't here. The dock union's under control. Put some of you guys on it. I'll send them over. And Lincoln, just cause Greco's a dipshit doesn't mean he's a pushover. He'll probably send out some of his men, have him try and take you out. So watch your ass. Get your hands on Greco and rough him up all you want, but don't kill him. That's for me. I was in the third platoon company C of the 614 tank destroyer battalion during World War II. I trained as a medic, but 
I still carried a gun. Every man in our company was black. The army didn't know what to do with us other than they didn't want us fighting with the white men. Mm -hmm. Klimbach. Klimbach was that little French town up there near the border with Germany and we were ordered to take it. Now the crowds took out three of the four anti-tank guns we had. There was no way in hell we were letting them get the better of us. We were determined to show we was just as good, if not better, than every other soldier in the service. I, I don't like talking about medals I got over there. Only way a man survives something like that is through the grace of God. Doesn't seem right celebrating a little piece of tin. No one knows I helped Lincoln except for you and John Donovan. Not that I'm keeping it a secret, mind you. Just that nobody ever came around and asked about it. Okay. Yes. Greco's in that building at the end of the block. A lot of whoas in there. Probably face down a pussy right now. This really yeah, is the other game. Yeah, a couple of meatheads. I'll go around the front, you take the back. He tries to run, grab his ass. Nobody kills that prick but me. Those are Marcano's guys. Come on, back to the car, you drive, I'll cover us. Fuck it, that little prick gets away. Is that? How the f*** go end up with my car? He's a little f That's how. God damn it. Why don't you just let Marcano handle this jackass? Marcano would just kill a little sh I want to take my time. Besides, until I can get at Marcano directly, this is the next best goddamn thing. Point taken. You lose sight of this, Lincoln. Well, they... Might do it. Vito agreed to work with Lincoln on one condition, that he bring him Michael Greco. When Greco escaped, Vito backed out. Switching that ammo! Look here, boys! Just like hunting swamp rats! We need to move! Closing in. Hey, get the door. Yeah. Unit. Suspicious individual in vehicle. Officers in the vehicle. It's not one thick the cops are on our ass. What happened? You crossed the wrong mother. That's what happened. Now shut up. Christ, oh God, fuck the f down, you big gorilla! What do you want, huh? 
for money, I can get you ass for money. You don't know who you're messing with, you baby. Right now. Responding unit. Back to your place. Yeah. Pull around to the chum shack in the back. And as for you, have a little dignity. Christ. Help! Help! Watch out for cops. Don't want to get pulled over with this asshole in the back seat. <laughs> For a couple of years there, I really thought I might be done with all the Jimmy Cag. But here I am. Uh, oh, oh, please! I didn't do nothing! You didn't do nothing? You were getting ready to f me! I was just doing what Uncle Sal told me to do! Nah, that f like me, I get it. But this? You never tried anything like this before. I don't... Come on, Mikey. Why do you want me gone all of a sudden? He said you were a carpetbagger. Never should have been down here in the first place. <laughs> you want me to keep going? You got nine more! Listen, Jesus! He was worried you knew about the casino! And so we're gonna play up to Leo and the commission! What casino? Answer the question. Uncle Sally's... You, you, you see that construction across the lake? He's building a casino over there. He wants to go legit. Turn this city into Las Vegas. Gambling's illegal. Uh, yeah, it's illegal. Uh, which is why he's paid a bunch of money to get the lost chain. Who else is involved in this? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I swear it. <laughs> I told you what you wanted to know. You're gonna let me go now, right? Man, this music crazy. Yeah, sure. <clears throat> Damn. Stupid. I'll clean this mess up. No reason for you to stick around. Remember our deal. I'm expecting to cut of everything you bring in. Yeah, I know how to sh so you'll get your money. There's a woman named Alma, helps me out sometimes. Cuban, mean as She talked to her, see if she needs anything. Might be an easy way to bring in some extra money. Where's she at? At the warehouse. All right. What are you gonna do with him? Fish gotta eat like everyone else. Oh. At what point did you become aware that Sal Marcano wanted to build a casino north of the city? Pretty early on. Michael Greco told Lincoln about it. And Lincoln Clay's plan was to specifically target various entities related to Marcano's casino plan? Between the bribes he was paying out to get gambling legalized and the money needed to pay off the commission, Sal was stretched pretty thin. So Lincoln used that to his advantage. Forced Sal into making some extremely hard decisions. Decisions that would limit his options. I'm telling you, we make twice as much bread moving heaven as we would from a casino. Maybe three times. This ain't about the money. <laughs> You're joking, right? All I ever heard from you is, don't give me that goddamn excuses, you understand? You pay me what you You think this is a game, <laughs> son. And it's my fault for playing along with you. We're not setting you straight. But it's not a game. Hands on you. Grind you down. I ain't had a decent night's sleep in 43 years. And then after Lucho. Well, hey, we got who did that. Every last one of them. Yeah, and your uncle's still dead, ain't he? Yeah. You think sitting in that chair makes you special, huh? Somehow puts you above all the... Well, it's the opposite. All it does is paint a giant goddamn bullseye on your forehead. There's a price to be paid for all this, you understand? And I'm tired of paying it. Mainly, I'm 
Worried I'm gonna get a phone call telling me you're dead in a gutter somewhere. What do you expect me to do, huh? Work the front door? Glad hand folks as they come on in, maybe give them a quick slap on the ass? You run it with me. And here, after a few years, after I know everything's settled down, you'll take over. Find yourself a nice woman. Give me grandkids. Sound boring as f. It's the only way, son. The world is changing. Used to be people knew their place. Now everybody's screaming about equality. Now they all deserve a slice of the pie. You name it. Our way of doing things won't work in a world like that. Yeah. You come to me with something like this, Lou, you better be goddamn sure. Yeah. Lincoln Clay is still alive. If y'all enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time.